optimizing your website for search engines in 2019 and 2020. Hey there, everyone. Complete internet marketing is all about enhancing your brand's online presence so you can generate more traffic, leads, and sales. And it all starts by optimizing your website for search engines. In this lesson, we are going to show you how you can optimize an existing website from scratch. We'll use WordPress as our content management system of choice because it allows us to make optimizations on the fly without coding or website design experience required. If you're using WordPress, then you'll be able to follow the steps in this lesson to the letter. But if you're using a different system, you'll simply have to apply the steps where they correspond. Step number one, installing a search engine optimization plugin. You have to keep your on-site search engine optimizations in check. With WordPress, you can simply optimize and refine on-site SEO by installing a plugin. The best SEO plugin for WordPress websites is Yoast SEO. To install the Yoast SEO plugin, just move over the Plugins tab on the left-hand menu and click on the Add New option. Now type Yoast SEO in the search bar and wait for the results. Now locate Yoast SEO in the results and click on Install Now. Now click on Activate. You will be able to optimize your on-site SEO after installing this plugin by moving over the Yoast SEO tab on the left-hand menu and selecting an area that you'd like to optimize. The plugin scans your site for SEO errors and provides you with recommendations to fix them, saving you all the guesswork. Step number two, add a meta description for search results. Now that you've installed Yoast SEO, you can use it to apply your first on-site SEO optimization, a meta description for all your pages. Adding a meta description will help you to increase search engine traffic to your site because meta descriptions help search users to know what your site is all about when your content pages appear in search results. Move over the Yoast SEO tab and click on the Search Appearance option. Now click on the Taxonomies tab and then on the Meta Description field to write your meta description. Rules to write the best possible meta description include making sure to include your main target keyword in your meta description including additional high-volume search terms in your niche, and including a call to action to invite search users to click on your link. Your meta description should be 155 characters or less, or they will look incomplete in search results. You can click on Save Changes after writing your meta description. Step number three, install a caching plugin. Search engines like Google measure load speeds to determine a site's ranking. One of the easiest ways to improve your site's load speed is by installing a caching plugin. A caching plugin will create dynamic copies of your pages to avoid loading the entire content every time that a user enters a page on your site. Our caching plugin pick is the WP SuperCache plugin, the most popular and user-friendly caching plugin for WordPress. To install the WP SuperCache plugin, just move over the Plugins tab on the left-hand menu and click on the Add New option. Now type WP SuperCache in the Search Plugins bar. Locate WP SuperCache in the results and click on Install Now. You can click on Activate after it is installed. Now move over the Settings tab on the left-hand menu and click on WP SuperCache. Select the Caching On option in the Easy section and click on Update Status. Step number four, optimize on-site SEO in the customizer. You can add some simple yet powerful SEO optimizations to your site structure to increase search traffic to your site. With WordPress, you can add these customizations with a few clicks of your mouse using the customizer. Move over the Appearance tab on the left-hand menu and click on Customize. Once in the customizer, do this step-by-step. -step. Start by clicking on the Site Identity tab from the left-hand menu. Click on Select Logo to upload a logo to your site. Now click on Select File to locate your image logo on your computer. Double-click on your logo to upload it. You can improve your site's discoverability by inserting niche keywords in your image's metadata. You simply have to enter a long-tail keyword in your niche to the title and alt text fields in the Attachment Details section. We recommend you to enter the same keyword in both fields. You can click on Select 
to continue after adding metadata to your logo. Now enter the name of your site in the Site Title field. Now enter your site's tagline in the Tagline field. Your site's tagline affects your ranking. A good site's tagline is simply a brief description of your site that includes your main target keywords, separated by commas. This will help search engine algorithms to better understand the topic of your site. Now move over Site Icon and click on Select Image to add an icon to your site. Here you can use a simplified version of your logo. Don't forget to optimize the title and alt text fields. These are all on-site optimizations that you have to add using the customizer. So you can click on the Publish button to finish and load them to your site. Now click on Close to go back to the dashboard. Step number 5. Install Share Buttons It is crucial to add share buttons to your site. The share buttons give visitors and content readers an easy way to share your content with others, which generates qualified traffic. You can add share buttons to your WordPress site the easy way by installing a social share plugin. Our top social share plugin pick is the Social Pug plugin. Move over the plugins tab on the left hand menu and click on Add New. Type Social Pug on the search bar. Now locate the Social Pug plugin in the results and click on the Install Now button. Now click on Activate. With these simple steps, you've just added share buttons to all your content pages. Step number 6. Activate search engine visibility and SEO friendly URLs. There are two additional SEO optimizations that you have to make sure are active on your WordPress website. First, move over the Settings tab on the left hand menu and then click on Reading. Find the Search Engine Visibility option and make sure that the box is unchecked. If it is checked, simply uncheck it and click on Save Changes. Now click on the Permalinks option in the Settings menu. Under Common Settings, select the Post Name option and click on Save Changes. This option will allow you to include the keywords in your headlines of your URLs to increase your site's ranking for those keywords in search results. And that is it for now everyone. Next up, we'll be showing you how to compose blog posts that are optimized to generate traffic from everyone's favorite search engines.